up, y'all? I said, what's up, y'all? Look at me when I'm talking to you, bro. Nah, I'm just messing with y'all, man. This your boy, Knockout Boxing 86 TV, and we in here. So check this out. Before I get going, hit my like button. Subscribe to the channel if you're new here. Share the video. Turn on your notifications. And don't forget, I go live Monday, Wednesday, and Thursday night, 7.30 p.m. Central Time. You can also catch me live Sunday mornings with the singing OG, KQKC Boxing Network at 9 a.m. Central Standard Time. And please join the channel so you can help the channel grow. The more channel members we have, the more people that are donating to the channel, the more time I get to spend dropping this content for you. But let's get it popping and get into our video. And today, there was some truth to the rumors about this heavyweight two fight, four top heavyweights on one car shit. Look like they really trying to get it together. You know what I mean? We don't care about being last over here. We don't care about not trying to break news. I won't wait till I get shit from reputable sources. And then I talk to y'all about it and let y'all know what I think, right? Amir Abdullah, who is the um, promoter over the Saudi Skill Challenge Entertainment. That's the name of the Saudi Arabia promotional company that's getting all these big fights to come to Saudi Arabia. He confirmed that they are indeed trying to make um, negotiations for Anthony Joshua to fight Deontay Wilder and for Tyson Fury to fight Alexander Usyk all on the same night. They're trying to get this shit popping in December. He said December, there's a specific date in mind, and once he wants to put that out, put put out that press release, we'll put it out. We have it, um, we have it ready, and those fights will be announced, but there might be fights before that also. Um, he said, so December isn't the first fight we're looking to do. It's a fight we're looking to do, and the names, and those names are in the mix. So whether AJ wants to take a tune-up fight and his management thinks it's good for him or whether he wants to go back down to Texas to work a bit longer with his new trainer, of course we would allow him to, um, to, to have a tune-up fight. Um, this is the business side of the sport. If he takes a tune-up fight, he's got to win the fight. It's not interesting to us if he comes off a loss, so he's got to win that fight. Let me tell y'all something, bro. Money talk. All that other walks, bro. Listen, I heard people saying that when this was floating around, Deontay Wilder ain't no co-main co -main event fighter. Anthony, Deontay Wilder ain't fighting on nobody co-main event. Neither with Anthony Joshua. Let me tell y'all something. They got... They got trillions of dollars, okay? Trillions. The richest person over here in America is Elon Musk. He worth like $191 billion. Because of that oil money, man, they got, a, bro, they got a trillion. That's like five or six Elon Musk in one person. One trillion dollars is nine hundred ninety-nine billion nine hundred ninety-nine million nine hundred ninety-nine thousand dollars. But like, do you understand how much a trillion is, man? And if you Deontay Wilder, if you Anthony Joshua, if you all that pride about I'm a co, I'm a main event fighter, I'm the headliner. I ain't gonna, you know, my pride, my integrity won't allow me. To be on somebody undercard, man, with the money that they offering, listen, you need to be, if you got to be on a preliminary card, if they tell you that your shit not televised, bro, you take that shit. I'm telling them, hey, man, look, this is how much I done, this is the most I done made. The most I done made is 50 million, 60 million, 70 million. Can you double it? Can you put another 20 million on top of that, bro? I'll, I'll open up the car. I'll open up the car. If you don't even want to televise my shit, you ain't even got to televise my shit, man. These are the types of things that boxing needs, though, in all seriousness. These are the types of things that will make everything else stop. There was a time when boxing used to make everything else stop. 
other sports, other programs, other networks. They would move their shit around for boxing. Mike Tyson, Evander Holyfield, shit got moved around. Shit got moved around, bro. Oh, shit. Basketball shit. We got to move this shit to another day. We got to start this shit early. Mike Tyson, Holyfield, that's what everybody going to be watching. Shit, we got to start this shit early. We can't do this shit. Now boxing be moving around for other shit. Be a big ass fight. UFC be on too. They be waiting on the UFC shit to go off and shit. Or they be trying to hurry up and get that shit over with before UFC turn on because they know everybody going to turn on to the UFC and shit. It be a... Man, I done seen them. And this ain't no disrespect, bro. Not even the NBA. It be a college basketball game on ESPN, bro. College basketball. They'll put the whole boxing card on hold and let the college basketball game finish. They never used to would do that shit back in the day when boxing was in its heyday. But something like this card they talking about, Wild the AJ Fury Usyk, that's a showstopper. That's where everybody else like shit. We, hey, it's December what? It's December what? Ah, right, yeah, we gonna move this shit around. We gotta make sure that we ain't got nothing going on this time, cause everybody gonna wanna watch that shit. It's an event. It's a spectacle. It's something that everybody gonna be paying attention to. This is the type of thing that will bring boxing back to the forefront, man. So if these four fighters are willing to do it, if they're willing to be a part of it, man, turn up. Turn up, bro. Like. It to me with them four, bro. It don't matter. Let me tell you something. I don't care what other card happens this year. If that card happens in December, it don't matter who else they throw on that bitch. It's the best card of the year. It's the best card of the year. You pick it. You pick you. You come up with your card yourself. You come up with your card yourself. Yo, you know what I'm saying? Spence Crawford. With a, with a Frank Martin, Keyshawn Davis undercard. Come up with whatever you want. Come up with whatever you want. This better. Because y'all know heavyweights run shit when it's popping. You mean to tell I get the undisputed fight between Usyk and Fury and the fight we've been wanting forever with AJ and Deontay? Bro, come on, bro. Did what oil money do, I guess. <laughs> Did what that oil money do, I guess. So they really are trying to make it happen unless, I don't know, Amir of, of, of Dollar, you know what I mean, from Saudi Arabia. He run their promotional company, they boxing shit. But I know they really trying to get into sports and shit. They doing that live golf shit too. They got the PGA pissed off right now. Taking all the PGA golfers, offering them bag after bag after bag after bag. Now here he come. Now here, here they come. They about to, listen. They about to, they, they trying to do some, and he said they already got a date. Sign me up. I don't care. I don't care what day it's on. I don't care if it's Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. They can have that hell on a Thursday, Friday. If they put it on Saturday, something, I don't care. Whatever else on, it don't matter, bro. I'm watching this. That's the way that you get yourself back in the forefront if you boxing. So I hope they do it, man. I hope they get this shit done. And Anthony Joshua, should he take a fight in between? It depends on how much money they offer him. I, I don't know if I, with his chin issues and his heart and his discipline, how shaky he be looking, man, you might just want to train your ass out for the rest of the year and just be ready for December. Because, boy, you, do you understand? You take a tune up and you lose and you drop the bag. You drop the bag, bro, and now they ain't offering it to you no more. Now, if anybody going to get that scalp, I want it to be Wilder, man. That, that's all I'm saying. If anybody going to get that, I, I need it to be Deontay Wilder, man. That's all I'm saying. But y'all let me know what y'all think. Comment below. Smash the like. Sub to the channel. Share the video. Turn on your notifications. Don't forget I'm live Monday, Wednesday, and Thursday night at 7.30 p.m. Central Time. I'm also live Sunday mornings with KQKC Boxing Network at 9 a.m. Central Time. I appreciate everybody watching. Enjoy the rest of your day. And with that, we out of here. Peace out, y'all.